Well, hey, 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 out there, everybody in YouTube land. Oh, mercy, if it's just not one thing, it's something else. Actually, I have pretty good luck. Everybody always asks me why I'm so dead gum lucky. I say God takes care of idiots and fools, and I get double indemnity that way. So nothing normally bad ever happens in my life. Everything seems to just kind of go my way. Um, <laughs> Overly blessed. Hey, hey, hey. Little sisterly love going on there. You girls settle down. I'm trying to talk to the people here, man. You ought to be happy. They both just got done scarfing down a Philly cheesesteak sandwich. They both got their very own six-inch sub, didn't you? Yeah, you ought to be happy, fat. I don't know what you're griping about. But anyway, I am at the pilot slash road ranger in Illinois and I just picked up a load Coca-Cola load running it up to Minneapolis and uh, anyway I pulled in here to the pilot to weigh my truck and when I was sliding my tandems something went pop and it quit moving and uh, I've checked it all out I didn't break a drive shaft and when you put it in gear, the drive shaft spins, but it don't grab nothing and it ain't making any noise, so it's definitely something in the differential. So I got a broken differential. Here it is Friday. Christmas is on a Monday. Chance of getting a truck into a shop and fixed before the New Year's you'd think is mission impossible. Well, my company has pulled some strings. They got a tow truck driver it's supposed to be here in 30 minutes. I'm gonna drop the trailer here in the truck stop and then talk to the manager and pilot, so we're all cool there. We're gonna run me down at, we're gonna tow this truck to a Peterbilt dealership down in South Chicago. And uh, they told me that they got another truck that's just coming out of the shop down there that I can jump in and take it. He gave me the number off of it. Now this is going to crack you up. It's my old truck. It's the one I traded for this new 2017. <laughs> so, I'm going to be back in my old truck for a couple of days until they get this one fixed for me. But man, that's just kind of crap, man. I, if you ever lived in one of these trucks, you don't like even being put out of it into another truck because, man, you got all your stuff in it. You know, you just don't want to go switching microwaves, TVs, all that kind of stuff out of the truck. Whenever you switch out of the truck, you just take the bare essentials. So you're living basically out of a suitcase for a week or so which I think kind of sucks but oh well things could be a lot worse you know I could be broke down 50 miles out in the middle of nowhere freaking Montana right but oh no where does my truck break down right here in the parking lot of the pilot I mean if that's where you're going to do it I highly recommend that's where you do it <laughs> anyway so I guess I'll swap out these trucks. Alrighty, babe. Turn off your GPS before you shoot a video. But, um, oh, I don't know. What else can I say, right? Anyway, I'll give you an update probably tomorrow. I'll let you know what's going on. What a hell of a way to spend Christmas. I wasn't planning on going home for Christmas anyway. I was going to stay out. But I expect to be running down the road and making miles. Uh, I get layover pay, breakdown pay. You know, I could be a real pain in the butt and say, no, I ain't swapping out trucks. Stick me in a hotel room. Nah, I'd rather be running. Anyway. 
Ought to be interesting. I might be spending the night at Peterbilt. May not be able to get back here tonight. Probably won't get back here until first thing in the morning. We'll figure it out as we go. Make it up. It really doesn't matter. I mean, I'm only 330 miles from my drop. And the deal is, is the load I got in the trailer, I can't drop it till first thing Tuesday morning anyway. So I would be sitting around there. We're going to just pay me layover pay. But now I get layover pay and breakdown pay. Yoo-hoo! See? Everything always works out for me. I'm telling you. So, anyway, it's all good. Take it with a grain of salt. Smile about it. Laugh about it. Be happy because you walk around being pissed off and with your neck in the dirt and ain't going to change a thing. So, might as well praise the Lord for all his good graces and keep on rolling. Anyway, y'all have a great day. God bless you. Hope that you get to spend your Christmas with you and yours and your family has a good get-together. Anyway, y'all have a good time and we'll see you in a day or two. Bye-bye.